Welcome back to Selling V Migration News. Please don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel. In this video, we will talk about taxes and finances as it's related in the immigration context. Let's get into the video. A lot of individuals asking about it, which is a good thing, which means we have a lot of individuals that are going to have their immigration interviews at the US embassies or consulates and their adjustment interviews. The question that most people ask a lot is, do I have to take my tax transcripts? Is it okay to take the 1040s? Do I have to take my W2s? What about the wage and account transcripts? What other financial documents do I need? Basically, it really depends on the US embassy or consulate where you will be having your interview. It also depends on your case type, but in general, you have to submit the past three years of your tax returns that is the 1040 but in case you don't have just take the most current tax returns including your w-2 there are some u.s embassies and consulates that stays they only want tax transcripts because it gives a detailed information about your income immigration has kind of gone back and forth about whether or not they refer tax transcripts returns or if they re if they refer the taxes with the w-2 and accompany forms the best thing to do is to have both for those who may be aren't familiar or haven't gotten this step in your case with a tax transcript you can go to the irs website to order your tax transcripts there and you can order it by mail or online if you order it by mail they can typically come within five to ten days also make sure to have both tax returns and your w-2s just to be on the safe side the tax returns documents are part of the requirement and plays a major role in the decision making of your visa make sure to add updated pay stubs do you own your business do you receive a w-2 and what kind of financial records you have as to what other financial documents you would need in general the requirement is typically three months of paycheck stub and prove employment that's a letter from your employer that that lists your position and date of employment for entrepreneurs it's a little different there are other requirements but in general those are the financial documents that would be required and you would definitely want to check prepare for your interview on the NVC website to make sure that this is the specific embassy or consulate that you are following their instructions so like I said earlier if you are having adjustment of status interview having those tax return transcripts plus other financial forms are really important so tax return transcripts or tax returns I say both just to be safe. Please share this information with family and friends who may need it. You can also help us spread the message by sharing it on all social media. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe and hit on the notification bell for more immigration updates. Bye!